Okay, obviously you can use the DJI Osmo Pocket 3 as a webcam, um, but what I'm gonna do today is show you how to use the Pocket 3 and the DJI Mic 2 uh, within OBS in two minutes or less. Super simple, one cable, two minutes of your time, and then you'll be able to capture you know, your, your Osmo Pocket 3 footage in OBS and then stream it to any platform you want. The benefits of this are pretty huge. Obviously, you get you know the benefits of Active Track, so you'll be able to get up and be away from your, your keyboard and your traditional condenser streaming microphone. You can get some more cool shots, maybe get Doggo in the frame a little bit. Come here, bud. Up. Come here. Oh, that's a good boy. That's my good boy. So yeah, the, uh, the benefits of having the Osmo Pocket 3 as a webcam and then the Mic 2 as your you know, wireless live streaming microphone are pretty huge. Um, even if you don't have the DJI Mic 2, you can still use the Osmo Pocket 3 audio within OBS. I'm gonna show you exactly how to do that in two minutes or less right now. Right, Moak? Okay, this is gonna be the quickest, easiest tutorial on how you can use the DJI Osmo Pocket 3 as a webcam and also the DJI mic to audio as a wireless audio solution for your live stream. To achieve this, you need one cable. You need a USB-C cable directly into your computer. That's gonna go into your Osmo Pocket 3, like so. We're gonna open and power on. We're gonna get the webcam screen. I'm gonna tap preparing webcam. Away we go, we are now in webcam mode. The next step, we're gonna go into OBS Studio. As you can see, I currently got it set up within OBS Studio. I'm gonna tell you exactly how you do that. This is basically as easy as it gets. We have uh, two things we need to set up, a video capture device and our mic and aux settings. So if you wanna use the DJI Mic 2 as your primary audio while you're live streaming, with the Osmo Pocket 3, you're gonna to wanna to make sure you power it on. So you'll get the vibrate, and then you will see that it is connected on the Osmo Pocket 3. So the first thing we're gonna do is we are going to add a video capture device. And that video capture device, we can call it whatever we want. And then inside that video capture device, if we double click, we are gonna select the device as the Osmo Pocket 3. Simple as that, we click OK, away you go. There is the, uh, the image with Active Track for the DJI Osmo Pocket 3 as a webcam inside OBS. The next step to get the DJI Mic 2 audio into OBS would be to come to this uh, mic levels meter here. There's three little dots. If we go ahead and click those little dots, click properties, it's gonna be the same thing in here. What we're gonna select is the Capture Input Terminal Osmo Pocket 3. Now, if you don't have the DJI Mic 2 and you wanna use the Osmo's built-in mic, it will be the same thing. It will, instead of using the Mic 2, it will just use the onboard microphones of the DJI Osmo Pocket 3. So it really is that simple. Now, we have everything set up to live stream here in OBS. Um, two minutes or less. From this point, all you're really gonna need to do is connect your Twitch, Kick, YouTube, whatever platform you're streaming on. Uh, connect those settings into OBS. There are millions of tutorials on that. But once you've uh, connected your streaming platform, click Start Streaming and away you go. You are active track streaming to your platform with the DJI Osmo Pocket 3 and DJI Mic 2, and this is so good because it frees you up from using something like a traditional you know, podcast condenser microphone, gives you the freedom to be able to walk around and talk and all that good stuff. Any questions with OBS or live streaming or anything like that, leave them down below. Hope this video was useful. If so, consider leaving a like. Uh, otherwise, until the next one, I've been UK, you've been fantastic. I will see you in the next one.